Hi all, this is Ankush and welcome to my YouTube channel. So before we get this video, I would like to request you kindly subscribe my channel if you don't and please like and share this video. Let's begin. So today's topic is we want to calculate the year to date versus previous years year to date in Tableau like the scenario is you need to find the which segment of the business grew the most year to date okay the segment could be different you can take it the reason or anything just i'll tell you how to calculate year to date versus previous year to date and tab look so i'm using the sample super student now once you know this how to calculate this kind of calculation you can calculate any of the data it it could be your the real world data your 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 working company you can calculate from there for demo purpose i am using the sample super store data so let's begin this so we need to create the bar chart first so i am using the segment and i need this as well as so we should know what we are looking for So which segment of the business grew the most year to date? So as of now, I am taking the sales. It should be the entire view and it should be the color. So, and another tip I would like to give you, like the shortcut way, most of the people and most of the we are dragged in this sales, any of the major to make it a color. So another the shortcut way just another way just a control and select the sales and drag it in the view. It will automatically apply the color. And according to yours, you can select any of the current side. Wait for this as of now. So now we need to place or uh, we need to create the first calculus which is year to date just here year to date sales so i'm saying if year of order date should be less than equal to year of today okay so today i am using because this sample super store data i have been updated this tableau so i'm so I have the full data till today, so that's why I'm using it today. If you don't have the full data, you are using the previous Tableau version, so you can use the max date. Okay. So the calculation says if year order date should be less than equal to year of today, and year of order date, if year of order date should be equal to year of Today, sales and end. So this year-to-date calculation is complete, and you can say this is calculation is valid. We need to create another calculation which is previous year to date sales. So again, we started with the if, if, date part, date of year, order date. Now you can ask, the question will be, you can ask me that why are you using day of year? Is there any function in Tableau? For, to be very frank, if you search day of year in this uh, search pane in Tableau, you cannot find this function in the search pane but if you go through the tableau website or uh, tableau blog it is a function tab day of year it, it will give the full data the previous full data this, this is a very good function i must say you if you are using the previous year to date you should use the day of year calculation okay. so if date part day of year order date should be less than equal to again i'm using date part Yeah. 
today and same year of order date should be equal to year of today so we are looking for the previous year data so i need to see one sales minus one then sales then end so you can see this calculation is valid since this is not in the search pane but still this calculation is valid so there are so many function hidden in tab loop you need to uh, read the uh, gen master blogs and craval so many uh, people are also there in tab loop so they will they will guide you how to use the hidden features is done so now we need to check growth percentage sales in this year okay the final calculation so we need to check which segment is the business growth the most year to date so i'm saying sum of let me filter it out all the calculation which i wrote so year to date is my the first calculation minus sum of previous previous year date is the second calculation and divided by previous year date to calculation and Combine this in one bracket, so it will give you the correct percentage. The default property I am applying for the percentage. Percent sales this year. This one, this one. Where this percentage? This should go column as well as so you can see, and this should go the percentage. Right. The color, color will be this and the short color. So this is have been created. Now you can see the home of office is the most grew the most year in to date. And same goes to corporate and consumer. Since you can create for the year-to-date versus previous year to calculation tabling.